Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm Gia and I'm Lux for Less. And today's video is the transformation of the Chanel uh, zip around wallet, zippy wallet that I bought at an auction. And as you can see here, it is seen better days. It is very dirty and tarnished on the outside. The inside though is very nice, but I thought, well, I'm going to buy this and I am going to stain it, color it, paint it, um, something else. I'm going to create something because it's such a great wallet. So I have to first start with the cleaning of the outside and then we're going to, I'm going to take you step by step of what it takes to the process of it, to paint it, to color it, to, you know, so it does not pill or crack and it lasts forever. Okay. And before we get started, um, if you guys can, um, hit that like button and please subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell so it can alert you to all my upcoming videos of how to, um, clean a vaquetta, how to clean the hardware like this, how to paint your Chanel wallet. Um, as you can see here, I put tape around the hardware because I'm not sure yet what I'm going to do here. And, um, but I first have to prepare the, the wallet and I got the Angelus leather preparer and deglazer. And I'm going to put that on the wallet to, um, I already cleaned it. I used the leather cleaner first and I then waited about 30 minutes and then I put the leather preparer and deglazer. You wait for that to dry and then we will move on to the other process of after that. Okay, as you can see here, I am putting on the leather cleaner and I am preparing it to clean. Like I mentioned before, I let it sit then for 30 minutes and then I put on the deglazer. Okay, step two is I put the leather preparer and deglazer on. I'm just waiting for it to dry now and then we will then start picking the color that we are gonna paint this wallet. Okay, now the fun part begins. I got that Angelus acrylic paint. I got that box there you just saw. I got that on Amazon and it has all the different colors. And I, you see here I have white, blue, black, and red. I'm definitely gonna try the white on the double C's, but I am not sure if I'm going to use the blue or the black, I'm definitely probably not gonna use the red as the main color on that wallet. So now I'm just preparing um, to get ready, but comment below, let me know what you would have um, put if the blue or the black or the red as the main color on that wallet. Okay, so I'm going to start with the white first on the C's. And the reason being is that way um, when it dries after I finish the rest of the wallet, I'm going to put a second coat on the C. So I'm gonna start with the smallest first and I'm gonna use a fine Angelus paintbrush for the smaller area. And then I'm gonna use either one of these two for the bigger area. I may also use a cloth to dip and that way you can actually um, it's kind of like staining. When you stain your, your wood, you use the cloth or some kind of type of sponge. So I'm thinking of doing that for the bigger area and then maybe using this for like to get into the other areas around the sea. I thought about putting a paint tape here, but I'm just gonna go real smooth around it and see how that works out. Not sure if I'm gonna use the black yet or the beautiful blue with the white. I'm not sure, but right now I'm gonna be starting with the white.
I think I'll try the blue on another wallet another time and we can see how that turns out. But I think I'm gonna just go with the classic black on this one. So here we go. So I'm deciding to go over the white with the black. I still need to put a finisher on and make it look nice. I have to still do black all around the edges here to be all black. So I'm gonna do that only because the newer Chanel wallets have it all black or all the same color. So I'm gonna do that plus this white. I've already done two coats and it doesn't look so good and it's gonna be easier to put the black over everything and then put a nice finisher over it. So we're gonna try that instead. Okay, we are done with the painting. I still have a little bit of touch up, but as you see here, I have the acrylic finisher to put on this beautiful Chanel zippy wallet. Look how nice that came out. So the zipper part, I still have to touch up, but the, re the rest of it, I can put the acrylic finisher on and just look at that. That looks so much better, so much better than when we first started. It took me um, about an hour and a half to do everything. I would say maybe a little longer. And that's 
that's just the painting and deciding what I was going to do. That was not the preparation of the wallet, but there it is. It's beautiful. And if you are enjoying this video, please hit that like button once again and hit the subscribe and notification bell. I am going to finish up painting around the hardware part of the zipper, and then I will show you the final product once I finish putting that acrylic finisher on. Okay, it is now done. The only thing I have to do is put leather conditioner on it. But what do you guys think of the wallet? Comment below. Let me know if you guys would have painted it all black or if you would have kept the, the double C's white or a different color. Um, comment below. Let me know. But And I will also put in the description below where to get these Angelus um, leather paint. So thank you for watching and let me know if there's anything else you guys would like me to create on video and I will try it. So until next time.